Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys some scarves. We're going through, trying some scarves on, talking about the fabric. These are all from Culture Hijab, as usual. I have a discount code for Culture Hijab. I will link that down below. All the names of the scarves will be on the screen, as well as in the description box. So if there's one that really pops out at you, because there's a lot of really cute ones in here, I think there's like a really good variety. We link down below, so you can go and shop on their site. And yeah, let's just get right into it. Show you guys. I have like two of these. They're huge. The first scarf we are going to be trying on is this one. This is a satin modal scarf. These are so nice. Like, I don't know how to describe this fabric. It's kind of like my dream fabric. They're very, very thin, which I like. So these are like the, these are the go-to for summer. If you need like a summer scarf, that's not gonna like overheat you. I would hop on this. I'm gonna just do like a simple throw over the shoulder for each one because we have a lot to get through. But look how cute this is. Like, mm, I love me a nude scarf. Like this is so cute. My makeup too. Mm. Mm. This one's called Almondine. Almondine, yeah. I love this. I'm, I didn't even know I had this. I'm gonna actually wear this. Today. Next we have a jersey. I'm kind of just gonna go all over the place. I'm not gonna like stay in one fabric um, So we have a jersey. This one's called Argan. This is really beautiful orange color I just love this color. This is my mom's favorite color. I already know she's gonna like want to take this scarf I actually should just give it to her. This one's nice Nice. I always feel like I shut her room whenever I have one like a jersey scarf Because she always is rocking a jersey. Jersey is not really my go-to for like every day, but they're definitely my go-to for praying. I don't know what it is, like I love praying in jersey hijabs. Like I really never wear them out. Like you guys probably never see me out wearing a jersey scarf, but whenever I'm at home and I make salat at home, I literally always throw on one of these because they're so comfortable. Like I usually wear pajamas, <laughs> usually like especially these days when we're all quarantined. You know, we're in pajamas at home, we're praying in like comfortable clothes. So I want my scarf to be comfortable too. These are just so soft, so big. They're really big, so that's why they're perfect for praying. But yeah, this is really pretty. I love the color. This next one is also orange, but y'all, this ain't the same type of orange. Okay, this one's called Aurora. I used to have a friend named Aurora. Whoa. Okay, this on camera, this might not look as like bright as it is, but you guys, I feel like my camera is not doing this scarf justice. This thing is so freaking bright. Like I wanna take a really cute picture in this. You guys know I have a love-hate relationship with chiffon. I like there's some days it just looks so good on me. And other days I'm just like, mm. it kind of depends on like my makeup, how my hair looks under my scarf. If my hair is too like bumpy, then the chiffon looks bumpy, it's just, you know. It's a whole thing. This is cute. Like this is crazy bright though, oh my God. It's so bright, like definitely people are gonna notice you if you wear this outside, like people are gonna like be like, whoa. Can we talk about how cute Culture's packaging is? Like I just love how each one comes. And sometimes when I wanna like re-gift these, um, it's just perfect because they're already like wrapped and the scarves don't like, you know, come apart. They're perfectly folded. Love the packaging. This one is so pretty, like, I just love like this type of nude color. Like it's like a pinky nude. This one with like a nude lip to match. I would rock the hell out of this. This is so pretty. There's something about like nude scarves that make me feel so like feminine. I don't know what it is, especially like a pinky nude. I just feel super girly and super pretty. I don't know what it is. They're just so pretty. I actually don't know if I want to take a picture in this one. I'm kind of tied between this and Almondine. You know, I gotta take pictures for the sun goes down because like, it's like three, it's like four, it's pushing four. So I got, I got like an hour or so to finish this video and take photos um, before the sun in my apartment like completely exits stage left. Um, most of these are still in the package, but this one I've actually worn a few times. It's like the perfect brown scarf very comfortable it's like cotton well woven viscose feels like 
you know cotton it's cotton but very breathable and very big and it, i find this scarf is a little bit more on the puffier side if that makes any sense so if you're into that look like they do give you a little bit more volume like as with like the chiffon they're very very flat because of the just the fabric that's just how the fabric is but this one is cotton and it gives you a lot more volume around your face because you can see it's like puffing out on its own which i do like sometimes sometimes i don't like a super flat scarf look same with hair like some people like their hair flat some people like their hair volumized it just depends on you know who you are so do you boo this one actually gives you some volume and it's very breathable we have another premium jersey scarf this one's a super pretty green color i feel like green is just perfect for spring i know it sucks that we really can't go many places but you guys can still go out and take photos go for a walk and take some cute pictures have a photo shoot or you know just like get dressed up to stay in the house some days if you feel up to it. if you don't you know that's cool i totally feel you on that but sometimes like just putting in the effort for ourselves can make us feel really good especially if you're like experiencing some depression or you just are really tired of you know being in the house just switch it up some days i have to tell myself okay today you're not gonna wear leggings you're gonna actually put on pants and you're gonna get some work done this one matches my makeup so good i actually put like green in my eyeshadow today i never know if i want to make my scarf tight around my face like this or if I want it to be like loose. But I feel like the tight look just looks so much more uniform. I don't know, comment down below if you're like a tight girl, if you like your scarf super like tight around your face, or are you more like on the loose side like me? Like I kind of just like my scarf to be like relaxed because I feel like I'm choking <laughs> if I like, you know, have it like that. But I think it makes your face look so like, like, you know, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Oh, we have some shirts. Okay, we have some tanks. I'm gonna show you guys these tanks. It's called the Crew Neck Ultra Smooth Seamless Tank. And this one is in taupe. And I've talked about these before a few times on my channel. This is what it looks like. I think these are really good for hijabis and just anyone in general. Like even if you wanna dress more on the modest side, I feel like these are really good for layering. I love pairing these with like a blazer or something like a jacket or something like that. Something you probably wouldn't wanna have like long sleeves for. This is perfect to throw on underneath. They're also kind of comfortable just to wear around the house. I'm not even gonna lie, like they're very slimming as well. So they kind of give you that almost shapewear look. Like they, they really suck in your, you know, your areas that you really just wanna look more like uniform. I have this one in white. The white from Culture is just so pure. Like it's so white, I get so, to wear these because they're just so white but they're actually really easy to wash like I've got makeup all over like a couple of these and it comes right off in the washing machine and I have mine in a size small medium of course you know every girl needs her black so I have a tank in black as well all the same size I have another premium jersey this one is in the color deep taupe and this is actually like the perfect name I love the I don't know what it is anyone else like like names of stuff like names of eyeshadow names of like anything like i just really like looking at the actual thing and seeing how the name relates to the thing i'm a lot more into taupes i feel like they look really good they're cool toned and i'm someone that wears a lot of warm tones so it's really nice to have cool tones in my wardrobe as well to kind of offset the, the warm tones i also feel like cooler tones look more professional i don't know what it is maybe it's just me but whenever i'm wearing like cool tones got on a blazer or got on my you know whatever i just feel so professional this one's called every it's a very tiny square satin as you can see these are a little bit difficult for me to wear just because i have a huge head number one my head is huge i also have a lot of hair you guys know i get braids my hair is usually like in some type of bulky ass hairstyle so unless my hair is you know straightened or you know like in a ponytail in a in a less bulky style then i could wear this you know like as a turban um but it's very small so i just used it as a headband this one is called a video it just looks like belts and like chains all over it and then it has this nice black trim and i don't know this scarf gives me beauty supply store vibes <laughs> not in a bad way this is obviously way better quality than the scarves you get the beauty supply but like 
you know the vibes comment down below if you know the vibes so for this one i could definitely like throw this on as a turban i like folding them into a triangle like this so that these two pieces are like this and then you just bring it up i'm not doing the best job you guys get the idea i just completely messed that up you guys get the idea oh god this one is so pretty this next one oh my god tell me this is not spring if you don't have it if you don't get any of these scars get wisteria okay but if my makeup matched if i had on like pink makeup this would be so cute but this is actually really cute with this like darker eyeshadow too it's super thin super airy and just like very breathable like i don't think i would ever get hot like a lot of people ask me i'm sure all hijabis have gotten those questions to people like oh my god aren't you hot oh my god it's summer oh my god you're wearing fabric on your head i know you're hot like of course we get hot but there are some fabrics that are just breathable and that just don't make you as hot i love this one can we just get a minute for the pastel yellow this one's so pretty look at her this is definitely perfect for spring i don't know why my lighting looks like so weird right now it's just so pastel like i've never seen a scarf this pastel really anywhere i think these so far are the most colorful it is chiffon chiffon is, like i said not my first choice but i would definitely bust this out a couple pictures you know this one is called Sargasso. Sargasso. I don't know how you're supposed to say it. It sounds Spanish, so I say Sargasso. 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 Blue scarves. I didn't realize this till like I posted a blue scarf picture like probably like two years ago. Blue looks really good on me, and I don't really own a lot of blue. Blue and red are like the two colors I really just don't have in my wardrobe. Red does not look that good on me, but blue it just makes my makeup and my skin look so good especially in pictures there's definitely color theory and the way that color matches up with your skin and your makeup and so some scarves really will just look so horrible on me like one day and another day they'll look so good so i think it just depends on like if it's winter if it's summer how dark or light you are how your makeup is looking or if you're not wearing makeup like whatever it is because there's there's some scarves like i would never ever throw something like this on without makeup does that make sense i just wouldn't do it i feel like it's too much i feel like a scarf like this is a statement or like this definitely a statement and i just would not throw it on with no makeup scarves like this or you know like this these are scarves that i would throw on with no makeup but for these like really bright statement scarves, I think makeup, not even like a full, full beat. You don't have to look this beat. Just like, you know, even a little mascara, like something. I feel like with scarves like this, for me, I need a little something, something on my face. But, you know, that's just how I feel. So that's probably why you guys, I like you guys will never really see me wear scarves like this on the day to day because I just feel like they're just more for statements you know so this next scarf is kind of like the chiffon version of the first scarf that i did which was this one this one is jersey i love that culture has like you know scarves that are like pretty much almost the same color in different fabrics because like i said we all like different fabrics people are gonna prefer different fabrics depending on just like who you are like it's just normal to have a preference if you're someone who likes chiffon you're not a huge fan of jersey i actually would opt for this over the jersey for every day like i said i wear the jerseys all the time in the house to pray in and just like chill in they're so comfortable but these are really pretty for just like outside i feel like chiffon just looks a little bit more elegant rather than something like cotton or jersey that's just my opinion yeah i probably would like opt for this one over the jersey if I had to be completely honest. This color is called Rose Brown and it's just like the perfect name for this scarf. I'm a huge fan of this color. I think this color is definitely more of a fall color, but you guys, like honestly, you can wear these colors any time of the year, but this is very, very pretty for like fall. This one is called Chive. There was another one called Chive, was this one, which is the jersey. This is the Chive jersey one. This is chive modal this one's a little bit lighter this one's darker so just depending on like what fabric you like you would definitely get the same you know vibe from either one of these this is chive modal you guys i don't know like i said i was about to take pictures and i don't know if i should take pictures in this this one 
Oh, but this one, this was like the second scarf I did. I don't know. I feel like green scarves look very nice on me. They really enhance brown, hazel, green eyes. So if you guys have brown eyes or hazel eyes, or honestly any color, but I feel like brown, green does something to brown. I don't know what it is, but I feel like any, any eye color would look really good with this scarf. The modal scarves are very airy, very lightweight, very breathable. You're not gonna be worrying about sweating in these. And it's summertime, you know, no one wants to be outside sweating. Obviously we're not gonna be outside that much. I don't even know if summer's gonna be open this year, but if it is, I highly suggest you guys check out the modal scarves and the satin modal. They're very, very pretty. They're very, very pretty. So that concludes today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you check down below for the links to all of these scarves. I think they're so pretty, whether you're hijabi or not, because that's one question that I get a lot from these types of videos is, you know, like, is it wrong if I wear a scarf and I'm not Muslim or, you know, I get those questions a lot and there's nothing wrong with wearing a scarf. Hijab has no religion. You can wear your scarf like this, even if you aren't Muslim. You can rock any of these in any type of style that you want on your head, around your waist, as a belt. You can do whatever you want with it. It's not offensive. So I highly encourage you guys, whether you're Muslim or not, just, you know, check out Culture Hijab if you are into scarves, if you're into wrapping your hair. These are really, really cute for like headbands. Um, I love culture because like even whenever I do shoots with culture, they always make sure to have different models, even models who aren't Muslim, to show that you can use these scarves in a really versatile way. I just did a whole video on how you can like make face masks out of, you know, scarves or any other household items because we are in a really scary time where, you know, people are sick. This virus is spreading. So if you have scarves at home, fashion a face mask out of it. It's not medical grade. It can't like prevent you from catching anything, but it is important to just be safe and it's better than nothing. It's better than walking outside maskless. So yeah, there's so many different uses for it. They're for everyone, not just hijabis. I just want to really emphasize that because it's just something that I see a lot circulating in my comments. That concludes this video. I will see you guys in the next one.